your side weather with Chief Meteorologist Aaron Christensen. Welcome back. Well, after a weekend with a lot of cloud cover, we do still have some clouds kind of hanging on at the airport. 63 degrees, partly cloudy skies, humidity, and a not so bad 50%. But I tell you what, those clouds are going to clear out as the evening wears on and into tomorrow. In fact, we're looking at mostly clear skies overnight into early morning hours. 48 degrees are low for Tucson. That is basically how we will start our Monday. And then warm to an afternoon high, topping out in the mid 70s mostly sunny skies and a look ahead on our forecast lots of sunshine this week we are going to be talking about your travel forecast I realize a lot of folks are getting out of Dodge for the holiday if not I do have a look ahead at the Thanksgiving holiday forecast if you're sticking around Tucson and the rest of that weekend as well. We put our clouds and rain into motion here from the last few hours and really just those thin cirrus level clouds hanging on here across southern Arizona. They're starting to sort of shred apart as the night wears on. So that's why we're calling for clear skies by tomorrow morning. The little bit of cloud cover that we had today certainly didn't impact our temperatures at all. A lot more sun today from what we had to work with yesterday. So our high temp soared to 77, 69 in Oracle, 69 Wilcox, 68 Sierra Vista, 71 for you in Nogales. Overnight, temperatures dipping to the 40s, 50s, 47 Marana, 52 Phoenix, 47 in Oral Valley, Green Valley at 46, 41 for Douglas, Cells and Gila Bend in the upper 40s. And warming in the afternoon to 67 for Oracle, 69 in Wilcox, 70 Sierra Vista, one above that in Nogales, 74 for Casa Grande, 73 Oral Valley and Green Valley. As well. So, as we take a step back, we look across the uh, entire western United States, we see a couple of things going on. The few clouds that were over us starting to shift to the east, ridge of high pressure moving in, not too terribly strong just yet, and then a storm system just beyond that in the Pacific Northwest. The storm system in the Pacific Northwest is really the only significant storm that we see impacting holiday travel Monday as well as Tuesday. Maybe a few spotty showers in the western lakes area, otherwise looking good as we bump ahead to Wednesday, one of the most uh, busy travel days of the year. The risk of any weather related flight delays is high in the northwest where that system is moving in. A little bit moderate here across extreme uh, western Texas into Mexico. Otherwise, really couldn't ask for better, better travel conditions uh, as we head into this holiday. Fairly quiet across the country. And by the way, if you're packing, Temperatures expected to be pretty mild, running above average for about three quarters of the country. So keep that in mind. If you're sticking around Tucson, though, Thursday, Turkey Day, 80 degrees, 80 on Black Friday, Saturday at 79. The rest of your seven day forecast does hold the promise of a few clouds come Wednesday, but not looking at any rain at this point. Smooth sailing with temps near 80 all the way through next weekend. Nine on your side at 10. We'll be right back with sports.